All right, fantastic. Okay, so emergency video, everybody. Hey, you going? Steve here, Command Center Wargaming. I just was there, organized something, and only Adonis has called me, and he's got some crazy news, some absolutely epic crazy news. Apparently, there's something going on with Blood Ravens in the next White Dwarf. So, Adonis, what did you see, man? What What did you see? So so next week's White, uh, White Dwarf, the one that hasn't been released yet, the back cover is a CG picture of the Blood Ravens advertising a, uh, a Starkey's Index for the Blood Ravens. Whoa! Okay, yeah. So, okay, so so first of all, what we know, we we know, now just to repeat this, just in case the audio is not picking up on the phone, because I just grabbed the phone, it's an emergency broadcast. Basically, so um, to recap, the CG on the back of the White Dwarf in two weeks' time, the new one coming out, is essentially um, is on the back of the cover and it's rules, it's index rules for the Blood Ravens. That's what you're telling me. Yeah, but it's not going to be in the uh, in next week's White Dwarf. It's going to be in next month. Okay, so next month. So not, not next week's White, White Dwarf. Next month's White Dwarf. Okay, that's that's crazy. Yeah, uh, index of starting is for Blood Ravens. It's index... Right, so Index Astartes Blood Ravens. The art is on the back from Dawn of War 3. Yeah, okay, so one of the CG ones from Dawn of War 3. So that's that's basically that's basically what we're what we're saying. Um, I'm gonna just try to do a quick Google for this now to see if anyone else is on top of it. Blood Ravens. Um Oh man, I'm so excited! I can't even, I can't even think. Index of Starties. Let's see if anyone else has popped up with anything. Um, yeah, I held the actual white, uh, the actual white dwarf in my hand. He wouldn't let me read it. Right, right. He wouldn't let me open it or any of that stuff. It was just, I got to see the advertisement on the back. All right. So it looks like, it, it looks like I just googled it, and it, and it looks like there are a few articles on it. Um, like I'm not going to mention like the people who are. Who were basically uh, who have mentioned it because you know like we're white there, but um, but apparently it says it's teased. I see the photo. I see the photo. Okay, right, right. So there are some photos of it, but we can now we can now confirm this. We can we can now confirm this that this is a thing because we've actually had someone witness it themselves now. What I what I am interested in, Adonis, and, and this is what, what I'm basically thinking, like which is why it's crazy. Did Games Workshop, did Games Workshop, yes or no, state that they were basically gonna be releasing a new codex for a chapter that had previously not had a codex yet? I remember that they yeah, did man, they did say that. As far as I know, there's only one model that's a four dwarf model for Blood Ravens. Which is Angelos. Which is Gabriel Angelos, right? So with a big hammer. Yeah. So the big, big demon hammer guy. The big the big demon kind of high, uh, hammer guy. So, so the thing is, is that see, I'm thinking just here, I'm thinking index, right? Where my brain is basically like it's just gonna be like some of those rules like we had for Crimson Fists and stuff like that. Um, you know, like like the two pages or whatever, but but here's the thing: like it says index, so like index, like as in Sisters of Battle, like a huge army, pretty much like a mini codex, man. That's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking it's gonna at least have some stratagems and a uh, a chapter tactic at the very least. A, a, as a as a teaser, as a teaser. But what I'm saying is, it's what's possible. Is that like not only can it have that, but it could be teasing for a codex coming. So it could be like check out some of the new stratagems that are going to be in the Blood Ravens Codex. Um, it's gonna, it's gonna be the big thing that's coming out. Well, well, that's what I mean. But that, but that's that's what I mean, man. Because the thing is, is they've been saying there's new Primaris waves, there's new stuff coming. They, I, I said it was going to be white scars, right, and like all that. But the thing is, is basically that like, that's a pretty big thing and it's something that they might do at the end of the year, like, oh sorry, halfway through the year because it's like, it's a massive release, kind of like Custodes level, but it's not quite like a Primaris release, you know, like, 
uh, sorry, not Primark, uh, Primark release, even though I think uh, Custo's release is a pretty epic, substantial like release. But yeah, oh, yeah. yeah. But look, fact of the matter is, we've got to confirm there's, I'm, I'm seeing other reports of it here. Now it's, it's, it's actually being witnessed by someone, you know, like yourself and you're, you know, and that's epic stuff. So yeah, so that's that's pretty crazy. Um, I I'm yeah, a big I'm a big hand, yeah man I'm a big fan of the Blood Ravens. Obviously from the computer game stuff, I've actually got a couple of squads of Blood Ravens. Would you believe it? Painted up in the old oh, in the, with the full with the full uh, with the full transfers and all. So uh, the official oh, transfers, yeah. So look that that's that's crazy. Um, that's absolutely crazy. Thanks for letting me know. Um, what um yeah cool. All right, well, so, yeah, look, probably some stratagems, probably a bit of a teaser, I reckon. I reckon I reckon we're going to be getting the Codex. That's what I reckon. I reckon that this this whole, oh, yeah, there's going to be another chapter that's never previously had a Codex before. I reckon it's this. And if, if Games Workshop, if Games Workshop don't do this, if it's, then I reckon they're crazy because this would be such a missed opportunity that, it would just be nuts. But anyway, yeah, that's oh, that's fantastic. Yeah, you know, some wild speculation, man. Like, Space Marines have needed some love for a while. Oh. I think that, like, as fan favorite as Blood Ravens are, I'm, I'm expecting to see some, some, you know, shoulder pads and things like that at the very least. Oh, 100%. Yeah, release. man. Yeah, like the and shoulder we pads. Might yeah. Get to see the, uh, we might even get to see some Space Marines in the top tier list again. Yeah, yeah. And I reckon, I reckon even like a Battle Box, man. I reckon, I reckon it could even be the mid-year battle box will be like Blood Ravens versus Black Legion or Blood Raven versus Thousand Suns or even Alpha Legion. In the game, they had a massive fight against Alpha Legion. Uh, I'm not holding my hopes up. I'm just an Alpha Legion fanboy, um, as you can see in the background. But, you know, I'm not holding my hopes up for that. But, um, but yeah. So, anyway. Cool. I saw the prices for the new uh, apocalypse boxes. Yeah, and they're great prices, man. They're like one hundred fifty thousand bucks each. Well, just it's crazy. Just before you called me, I was actually just about to do a video on on them on the battle boxes, and I probably will do a full video on them anyway. That's actually what today's video is meant about. Like literally, just before you called me. Um. So, so how much did you say they were? Well, I, I saw the paperwork. Uh, while I was there, we we're talking to the shop owner whose name I can't mention. No, no, you don't mention yeah, anyone's name. We, no. we saw the price list, man. They're like 155 bucks each. Even the night box is 155. 155 bu bucks each, and and that's and that's uh, so that's in US dollars, yeah. correct? Yeah. So it's about maybe 200, yeah, 230 yeah. AUD, maybe like you know a little bit more uh, UK pounds. So yeah, which is fantastic deals, man, and. I was hoping that because there's some epic stuff in there. But anyway, look, what we might do, I might we might talk about the battle boxes in another vid. Um, yeah. because I actually wanted to do a video on that anyway. And um, I wanted to actually go through every single little um like every box and just talk about like the units inside it, the values and things like that. So um, but I mean that even that night box, man, you think about that. If if you're looking at like let's go with uh, US dollars for a second, which is all we really care about. Um, so basically, like, so US dollars, um, is, say it's like 155 US dollars for that night box. Man, you're, you're, you're literally getting, that is so crazy value. You're getting the Castellan in it. And from what I can see, it was two armages, right? Castellan and two, uh, Castellan and two Helverns from what I Helverns, yeah, yeah, that's right. So Helverns. It's like a free set of Helverns plus a discount on the Castellan. Yeah, exactly. So literally, you get your, 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 your Helverns with your Castellan and your chicks for free. You know, so all good. Your money and your oh, nothing, yeah. chicks for free, whatever. But basically, that's 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 crazy stuff. So, man, like the value is crazy. Like, I mean, I've already got some, but I'll I'll go down, dude. I will buy that box just for the Helverins because I don't have Helverins, but I got a I got a I got a Castellan. Man, I'll, I'll I'll convert it to a Chaos Castellan. Alan Morris, um, in the comments there, buy, was... some, uh, buy the uh, buy the weapons for the Valiant and uh, run it as a Valiant. Yeah. Exactly. It will magnetize it, yeah. Alan, Alan Morris was asking me just then, actually, uh, a day ago, saying, Steve, like, what he is, he's already have, he already has Predator in his, uh, in his Chaos Army. And he asked me, he said, Steve, like, what um, should I put in, like, what else can I put in anti-tank, like, in my Chaos? I'm like, you know, this, this, that. And it's like, okay. 
you know and then it's like why not just put in a renegade knight like seriously like why why not just put in a renegade anyway so we'll, we'll get into that in other videos but all right everybody look uh, you've heard it here, everybody. Command Center Wargaming. I'm going to have a bit of, more of a chat with Adonis here. Um, but that's absolutely freaking crazy, fantastic news. And uh, I'll catch us in the next video. Let us know in the comments down below what you think is coming up. What you think, or maybe you know something about what's going on with the Blood Ravens. Um, and it's definitely epic times for sure.